Good morning, everyone. It's Bonnie Dotson with Pool Mountain Realty Construction, and this is your Thursday tip. So, um, this morning on the blog, which you can find at www.coolmountainrealty.com backslash blog, or you can hit the blog tab on our website. Um, so today on the blog, um, we're talking about how to um, stand out as a real estate investor. So, um, this article uh, was written by one of their investors at Forbes magazine, like in their real estate department. So um, he talks a lot about buyers um, and the best way, you know, in this time to stand out as an investor. So if a seller has something on the market at the moment, you know, it's definitely um, happens a lot to where you have multiple offers. So um, he talks about how to things that you can do to stand out so that, you know, your offer might not be the highest, but it might be the one that they pick. Um, it talks about, you know, um, as an investor, not just thinking about the investment, but thinking about um, the seller and um, not catering to them, but having a conversation and understanding, you know, they're selling this property for a particular reason and, um, you know, and kind of having that in-depth conversation as, you know, about them instead of the investment property. And then it talks about um, different ways financially, um, like um, ways that you can help out the seller, you know, to make um, the contract or what you're offering more appealing. Um, he goes into detail on all of that stuff in this blog today. So you guys make sure you check that out. Um, I'm sorry I'm coming from um, inside the house today because um, it is crazy cold outside and there was frost and I was not about to sit outside in that this morning. So I've not had enough coffee and um, to <laughs> weather the cold this morning. So I hope everyone is doing well that you go and check out the blog this morning. Um, and again, that's at www.coolmountainrealty.com. Um, and uh, we will see you guys on the flip. Stay home and stay safe.